The sky is falling and so are mortgage rates. Well, that's not exactly what's happening. There's a lot of conversation about mortgage rates in this year, 2023. They've been up, they've been down, they're going up, they're going down, we don't know. And there is a lot of confusion for consumers. So I wanna break down the basics of what makes up a mortgage rate for you. It's a lot of conversation that the Fed is raising the Fed fund rate. That rate has nothing to do with mortgages, or I guess I should say very, very little. What drives mortgages and mortgage rates are mortgage-backed securities and treasuries. And that is completely separate from the Fed fund rate. So when you hear that the Fed is raising the interest rate, that's for short-term loans like credit cards, HELOCs, maybe automobile loans, but that really has very little to do with mortgage rates. So if you want to have a full breakdown of what makes up a mortgage rate and what determines, click below and I can get you started on some basic info so you can guide yourself on the mortgage process throughout 2023. Mortgage rates are tied to mortgage-backed securities and the Treasury Department. Mortgage-backed securities is an asset that investors um, place their money in and it's relatively secured because it's tied to pools of mortgages. Millions and billions of dollars are pulled together for group investors to come into. It's a lot of what our 401ks are invested to because it's typically a secured and stable market. It's regulated slightly after the home crisis of 2006. The government came in and put some restrictions on these. And so mortgage-backed securities are where a lot of people place their money on the bonded treasury market. That is what dictates and determines our mortgage rates. And so me as a lender, um, it is my job to help you get pre-approved, walk you through your numbers of your payment and your rate and your cash for closing. My number one job is watching that bond and treasury market so I can have a good idea of rates gonna go up or down in the short term, like when you are getting pre-approved and going under contract for your loan. I don't have a crystal ball and I can't tell you what rates are going to be um, a month, three, six, nine months down the road. What I do know that my job, a part of the complete mortgage team, is to monitor the bond and treasury market, educate myself on what is going in the economy and what is driving rates. And that's not something that a typical consumer can do or your average everyday loan officer, quite honestly. So I spend a lot of my time watching and monitoring the market. A good portion of my day, probably 80% of my day, I focus on that bond market. And why that's important to me is because I want to make sure that I can guide you and help you get the best rate during your process. Now, one thing that I also pay a lot of attention to is what's going on in the foreign economy. Not just here in the US and our economy, but over 65% of the people that are um, invested in mortgage-backed securities here in the US are in the Asian Pacific market. 65% of our mortgage-backed securities for US mortgages in real estate is owned and invested in the Asian Pacific communities, 65%. So if their markets start to change, if their economy starts to change, if any of those countries like Japan, China, Korea, make major fiscal and economic changes in their parts of the world that affects their consumers and how they invest into our economy, that can change things for our mortgage industry and our mortgage rates. And most loan officers have no idea that that has such an impact. And so they're worried about the day-to-day -day consumer getting paperwork and, and whatnot, but not really looking at a broader view of what's going on. So here at the Complete Mortgage Team, I partner with Amy. She is my loan partner. You can check her out on our site. She takes care of the day-to-day -day for the clients, making sure their questions are answered. They have numbers and pre-approval letters ready for them when they go to look at homes over the weekend. But I monitor what's going on in the economy here in the U.S. and foreign, making sure that we're giving great advice and sound advice to our consumers and people that come to our team to use us um, and need help with this real estate investment strategy, whether it is your primary residence, a second home, or you're getting into the investor pool. That's my job, and that's how I want to help guide you. If you have questions about this, you don't know what I'm talking about, please reach out to our team. We would be happy to work with you, guide you through step-by-step, 
understand that a mortgage rate is much more complicated than what you see advertised on flyers or sponsored ads on social media. We want to take care of you. Reach out to us and let's get started today.